Hey there folks, today I'm gonna show you how to create a floating bubble animation in just a few minutes. Relaxing, light and oddly satisfying. Trust me, it instantly makes your screen feel chill. Let's get started by creating a composition. I'm going with full HD and 24 frames per second, classic. To create our bubbles, grab the ellipse tool and draw a circle. Remove the fill and keep only the stroke. Set the stroke thickness however you like. Thin, thick, go wild. I'm renaming this layer to bubbles, because, well, that's what they are. With the layer still selected, click the ellipse tool again and draw a smaller circle inside the previous one. Now, in the layer parameters, find ellipse tool Right click it and choose convert to bezier path. Tada! Now we can bend and shape it like it's made of clay. Switch to the selection tool, grab one of the points and squash that circle into a cute little droplet. Turn on fill, remove the stroke and match the fill color to the stroke from the outer shape. Next, head into the transform settings and rotate the shape using the rotation parameter. Position it nicely and boom, one little bubble, ready for takeoff. Now let's animate it. Find the position parameter and create keyframes. Our bubble will float from the bottom to the top. Set the final position at around the two second mark. Then we animate the scale Add keyframes at 0, 1 and 2 seconds. Set 0% at the beginning and end and 100% in the middle, like a smooth pop in and pop out. Add easy ease to make the movement nice and natural. We don't want it flying like a brick, it's a bubble after all. Right now it's floating in a straight line and honestly, kinda boring. So let's spice it up. Grab the Convert Vertex tool and edit the motion path to add a little wobble. Next, we add the Turbulent Displace effect to give our bubble a wavy, slightly melty look. Reduce the amount to 25. Perfect. One last touch, the Deep Glow effect. It adds a lovely soft glow but don't overdo it, unless you want your bubble to look like a Vegas sign. And there you go, one beautiful animated bubble. Now just duplicate it a few times, change the sizes, adjust the paths and fill the whole screen with floaty magic. If you enjoyed this tutorial, hit that subscribe button, drop a comment or at least leave a bubble emoji. Thanks to you, this video might float its way into the YouTube ocean.